I highly recommend that if you use a manifold gauge set that you use these manual low loss valves on the end of your hoses. So regardless of whether you use a compound set or a digital set or even uh, T's and probes, you're still gonna need a hose in order to add the refrigerant into the system. And of course the whole point of T's and probes are to avoid using hoses, but if you do need to add refrigerant or recover refrigerant in a system, this makes it very, very easy. And so you can control the flow, you can charge a little at a time into the system. It also allows you to, uh, once you charge, say like you shut the valve off down here and you charge the liquid that's in this hose into the system, as long as you're not overcharging it, you can shut this valve off uh, before disconnecting. And this way you don't have all the vapor coming out of this hose right during the disconnection process. And so that's really helpful. So I really prefer using these types of hoses with the manual low loss valve built on instead of these hoses without a manual low loss valve or with adding one onto that hose or with adding an automatic low loss or even a backseat device such as this right here. I really prefer using these manual on off valves that helps you to be able to say purge air out of the hoses, control the refrigerant accurately, charge refrigerant properly. So I think these are really beneficial and safe for any time you need to use a hose.